Hello world, I'm Maya Sundermeyer and I would like to welcome you to the latest episode of my blog series. I first of all would like to um, excuse myself on this voice. Yes, it is begin getting a little hoarse and um, I am managing to drink some lemon juice and take some vitamin C and get myself enough rest so that I will be well for Dragon Con. But basically what I do with these blogs is I um, like to talk about my experiences of what it's like for me to live with autism. And then I like to um, give my two cents on what's going on with autism in the media. And three, I like to cover topics that I am passionate about that have absolutely nothing to do with autism whatsoever. And in this uh, blog, I would like to give you guys another update on Dragon Con since it is a really, really big deal for the nerd and geek world. And as I had mentioned before, I would like to turn my blogs into a, a utopia for the nerds and the geeks. And uh, once I get enough people, I would like to do my own live shows and I would like to do my own mini Good Morning America for the nerd and geek world. Since um, Good Morning America doesn't seem to really c go into depth on things that nerds and geeks really like. And I really think that uh, it would be a place that they could go where they wouldn't feel so left out by the media. So anyway, so here goes. Uh, Dragon Con is officially two, uh, was it four days away? And today is the 24th of August, and I'm really excited about it. And I know everybody um, watching this video was getting just as jittery as I am. I mean, number one, I always get so excited about what the badges look like every year. And because uh, each year they have a different theme. And so every time I, get, I walk out of the train station and I see people with their little lanyards on, wearing their badges, and I say, excuse me, can, can you show me what this badge looks like? And yeah, I mean, it's either a yay or nay, but it's always interesting to see what these badges um, have each year. And um, who is uh, responsible for the badges? Um, anyway, um, other, things, uh, other things in the update. Um, I did manage to go to Dollar General and I'm still doing the peanut butter sandwiches and I did get the peanut butter and I got um, I got the crystal light there and I got um, three protein bars and I got three things of string cheese but uh, as far as bread goes I didn't need to buy it well every other week they have Panera bread that um, gives us a bunch of bread or they, they donate so I had I got a bunch or several slices of white bread. I mean it's big bread. It's it's nice big bread. I mean they'll be big enough sandwiches and uh, so I can just basically make a sandwich and cut the piece of bread in half. Well, uh, that's how big it is. Um, I also I mentioned I got the Crystal Light. I uh, re did not buy the the cans of tomato juice there because I just kind of felt like I'd be wasting my money. Uh, I went over to Walmart and I did a price check on theirs and um, they're charging a little less than what they were charging for four cans of soda which kind of would be a waste of money and uh, there's six cans for 350 or a little more so I cannot turn that deal down I have also decided not to get that 20 pack of chips that turns out they have an even cheaper price a dollar fifty for six packs of little Lay's potato chips and I, I think that's fine and then I'm also probably going to bring along some bagels and eat them along with my protein bars so I have some grains. And I'm also going to do the string cheese and I'm going to have the tomato juice for breakfast. And then I thought maybe I would go out to breakfast either um, one day, I think. I don't know where I'm going to go, but I wish they had a McDonald's at um, Peachtree Center. It would be really, really essential. I mean, I know they have checkers, but I don't know if they serve breakfast there. Um, anyway, I mean, other than that, I think I'm pretty much all set. And uh, I have another really, really big announcement that I want to tell you guys. Okay, since I have YouTube and since I have, I'm in good standing and I have enough points or whatever you want to call it, um, it turns out that I can do some live stuff at Dragon Con. And uh, for those of you that go to the convention that can't this year, uh, please note that I will be videotaping the parade live and I hope you guys um, will be pumped up enough to watch the parade so that you don't feel so left out. So, Other than that, until next time, my name is Maya Sundermeyer and I'm signing off now. 
As I said in my last video, happy Dragon Con.